We are just over two weeks until the start of the Toronto International Film Festival. Liam Vu sits down with TIFF's organizers to find out what they are looking forward to the most this year. TIFF 2016, close to 300 feature films, over 100 short films from 83 countries. Uh, what are you excited the most about for this year's festival? Excited to be kicking it, the festival off this year with The Magnificent Seven, uh, Antoine Fuqua's back, Denzel Washington, but this time joined by an incredible ensemble cast. Welcoming people, I mean, that's the thing. You're, there's so many friends that come to the festival. Do you remember that first movie or that movie that sort of clicked with you and made you realize that Oh my gosh, I love film. I saw um, Close Encounters of the Third Kind when I was a kid, and I went to see it five times, believe it or not. Weekend was one of them, and Pierre Lefou, done by the same director, Jean-Luc Godard. Not well known, but a huge, huge art house name. Has there been a movie in the past where you selected it for TIFF, and you're thinking, this is gonna be big, this is gonna win the awards, this is gonna win over the audience, and then it actually happens after TIFF? I remember that happened with Slumdog Millionaire, which seemed like a bit of an orphan film. It lost its studio just before it was finished and was uh, eventually picked up and went on to win Best Picture of the Academy Awards. King's Speech was another one of those films you kind of like, yeah, I really liked it, I enjoyed it, but it was very personal for me. Last year, we saw this film that I was incredibly moved by called Room. Any sort of tips and tricks for people who will be embarking on TIFF? Find a film from a country that you're curious about but have never been to, uh, a director that you don't know, and just go beyond the red carpet movies and then uh, hydrate and eat healthy food because you're going to need your energy.